I'm Tova, and uh, I'll talk about uh, data today. And I, I'm sure uh, you're hearing big data, data, data from everywhere all the time, and the fact that we're flooded with information and we have to do something with it, and so on. Uh, but today I want to talk uh, not about the traditional kind of big data that uh, we usually find that sits on the disk in the computer, uh, but rather on a different kind of uh, big data, which is actually the data that is sitting in people's heads, my head, your head, uh, everybody's uh, uh, brain, and what can we do with this kind of information. And uh, uh, we're already doing quite a lot, and I'm sure uh, you yourself are all using uh, uh, people's knowledge all the time. For instance, is there anyone here that doesn't use Wikipedia? I'm sure all of you do. Uh, so, Wikipedia is the standard example for a, a knowledge base uh, encyclopedia that was created by people, for people, collecting uh, uh, knowledge from, uh, uh, from humans. Uh, is anyone not using TripAdvisor? Well, you all travel a lot, I can see. Uh, so that's yet another uh, example of a knowledge base where people contribute their opinions on hotels, on restaurants, on uh, uh, other things, and people are using it. Uh, but there are also other kinds of uh, uh, things that we do with human knowledge. Does anyone know uh, Galaxy Zoo? So Galaxy Zoo actually is a computer game that my children really, really like. It's a computer game where the players are... Uh, uh, um, uh, look at uh, pictures taken by the Hubble telescope, and uh, uh, the computer is asking them a lot of questions about these pictures, uh, especially of uh, galaxies, okay? And uh, uh, they're asked questions like, is this galaxy oval? Is it round? Is it bright? What color it has? And so on and so on. They're asked answering uh, questions uh, very, very fast, and they get points for it. And at the end of the week, there is the galactic prince or the galactic uh, princess, the one that, uh, won, uh, uh, that answered the uh, largest number of questions, and so on. Now, you may be asking yourself, okay, uh, what does this have to do with uh, uh, crowdsourcing or wisdoms of the crowd? Well, Actually, what is happening behind the scene is that all these answers that my children and the other players of the game are, uh, are answering is, are collected actually in a big knowledge base, annotating the pictures of the galaxies uh, uh, that are there, and, and then they're actually used by researchers that are searching for galaxies with certain properties, uh, uh, for, and they get this information from the knowledge base. So my children and the players are actually helping these researchers to find what they need. Another 